Hey guys, Lots of Bean here and welcome back. We are now on to Mandalorian episode 6. Um, I enjoyed last week's episode um, a, a lot more. Um, I like it when the Mandalorian is its own kind of little thing and so I feel like the first part of this series has kind of just been stumbling over its own feet. I feel like they really should have just started off with Mando and Grogu being separate. I still do not understand what the decision was to reunite them in a separate TV show. It's just bizarre. So I feel like a lot of like the plot about this should have been or kind of is about him missing Grogu and like the, the, the like this family but what, what we've got is this kind of waffle at the start where we could have had Grogu reintroduced like halfway through but anyway it's starting to find its, its own feet um, last week's episode was I think fun I think that's what it was it was just really fun and silly and Star Wars and like what we can't come here for um, but yeah I enjoyed the pirates of uh, Nevada they were a bit silly but you know some good action scenes and it'll be interesting how this will go I generally don't know how the season is gonna end again it's all being over the place and they're all building up these little plot threads that will show how the New Republic is failing and how the First Order will, will rise from that and you know cloning and Palpatine but yeah um, it'll be nice to see I don't know how many I think it's eight episodes a season but it'll be interesting to see how they will wrap all this up and yeah let's get on with it I won't go I oh. won't go we love each other sorry okay folks. you have to go with them no I love you Please, How don't. old is this guy? How old is she? He seems a little bit young for her. Is that all this was to you? Ooh, that is a nice place, guys. There they are. Oh, it's all right. <clears throat> He's like, yay! Grogu's like, yay! Ooh, it's just a pretty place, though. Damn! Oh, that that goes fast. Like, why is that Jack Black? <laughs> I didn't even. Re Why is that Jack Black? <laughs> okay, guys. Oh well, he was um, Grogu. You should. <laughs> Oh, they have them. Hmm. The office stands none Press F for dark. Oh, who is that? I can no. I don't wanna watch that one. Turn them off. Ooh. What? Turn that off. Why not turn them off? Our citizens wouldn't know how to survive. That is pathetically survive. sad. Collapse. That is then what so sad. Want from us? To seek out See what happens when you rely on droids. Are you taking this personally? Mm. Just pointing it out. I have spoken. Mm. That worked. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> sir. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> there goes one. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Uh oh. I never thought I'd see an episode about an out of control droid. Nice! You did it your way, now let me do it mine. <clears throat> okay? They're already like an old my couple. <clears throat> no humans allowed. Get out. <laughs> Can I help you? Well, at least they were nicer rather than not just to kick them straight out. This is. Gives. <laughs> the word. Stay where I can see you. Count. 
we don't want to be replaced. We still have yeah, I remember like Van Den Dubros being annoyed at, at the so Jordan so like solo being all about joy rights, but shouldn't that be a massive thing in this galaxy? These are the remains of the latest malfunctioning droid. Gross, they put them in a morgue. Uh, quite a lot! Jesus! Our head of security, Commissioner Hellgate. Oh, there he is. You programmed them to disrupt an attack. You're coming with us. <laughs> Oh. Everyone freeze! I support democracy. Oh. Duku was a visionary. Oh, he was cut short in his prime by the Jedi enforcers. Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Despicable. If that isn't the Quacta calling the stiffling slimy. Oh. I beg your pardon. Sorry to have disappointed you, my lady. Perhaps someday I can earn such forgiveness. Nah, you're good, man. Yo, excuse me. You are now a knight of the ancient order of independent regency. <laughs> it's a baby. Go in peace, brave child. I'm quite fond of it. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go, people. Let's go. Oh! Ouch! Din's just like, what do I do here? <laughs> oh! Does that count? Would this blade then? But that's just on your word. They haven't seen it. But it seems like these people take things on their word. I return this blade. That was Christopher Lloyd. Jack Black is recognizable in anything, but I forgot about the casting of Christopher Lloyd in. The Mandalorian and Black and Christopher Lloyd in this episode of Mandalorian, yeah. They weren't you well Christopher Lloyd was the character was, was obviously like the separatist villain. Um but they were used rather well, sparingly. But you know what? Uh, it was nice just to kind of see them in there. Uh but yeah. Uh let's go through this episode more of um Mando and Bo sort of building uh strong like relationship like they do work well in a team and now she's got the dark saber um yes i was thinking back to is it like a case of high potter whoever disarms the person are they now the rightful owner of the dark saber so it clearly does work like that so she did beat the creature that beat mando so technicality i was hoping for a little bit of a a battle, not gonna lie. I, I I was hoping to see them be on the opposite side after building such a stronger relationship, but who knows, maybe that can still happen. I f I, I've got a feeling that there might still be a divide between them that there is going to be conflict, but who knows? It seems like they would make a good team. They would make ruling Mandalore together. They, would, I think they, they'd be good with that. I don't know what exactly they're building up with, but it would be interesting if they are going to put them together. I don't know how everyone will feel about that, but who knows? See, so yeah, I enjoyed this week's um episode of Mando. I like it when it's just kind of its own little thing, and you know, obviously it is building up to the sequel trilogy and filling it in the gaps rather beautifully. Uh, with the episodes, but it's nice just to sort of it be its own little thing. 
because uh, I feel like this season so far is kind of being all, all over the place. Um, so I haven't enjoyed this season as much as I enjoy season one and season two. Uh, but yeah, let's hope it keeps it up and I'll see you next week. Peace.